Hello everyone, welcome to Intech Space's video where changing your frame rate from 30 to 60 or 48 or whatever the case may be. So we're going to learn how to change our frames per second in Cinema 4D from, you know, the typical 30 in which, you know, it's kind of like that, it's kind of that cliche of, you know, same video frame rate and whatnot into a nice, uh, better and smoother uh, video where it's going to be a 60 instead of 30. So uh, basically all this is just a heart exploding and where the camera's kind of, the camera guy's kind of nervous. So I put a vibrate on the camera so that it looks like no, no, without any rotation or scale, it's just position, so it's just moving in a weird way. So anyway, the heart is just going to explode at 61 frame frames, and then that's when the camera guy or the camera girl or whatever is just going to be like kind of scared and just back away and still have that nervous feeling. And that's all it really is. It's just a simple four second video of a heart exploding. Now, in order for you to change your frame rate, you would think that you go to project settings and then change this to 60. Well, that's not really gonna happen. It's actually gonna, it's like, it's as if you're fast forwarding the entire video. So instead of, uh, you know, this being at one second, it'll be just all of this in one second. And then that's all it's really gonna do. It's not gonna really give you that physical 60 frames per second where it's much more smoother and still four seconds long. What you wanna do is go to your edit and then project settings. And I already have it out, but over here, you're going to see FPS with a bunch of dots. You're going to want to change, change this to 60. And if you press enter, this uh, timeline should double for you. So for example, mine was at 120 when it stops or when it ends and then it'll restart to zero. Now it went all the way to 240, which also means that at 121, that's when my uh, the heart will explode. And then that's when the, the camera will back up and just get a little more scared. But however, it'll still render that 60 frames per second. I have the original clip, but knowing YouTube and uh, Facebook and all of them, they don't really handle 60 frames per second yet. But um, I prefer to kind of do a render at 1920 by 1080. Um, a lot of people usually do this at 30, or they would do 1280 by 720 at 60, which I never never really seen the reason why you can't do 1080 at 60. But anyway, I uh, just want to show you guys that simple little video on how to change your frame rate in Cinema 4D. And uh, don't forget to give this video a like, comment, and subscribe to Intech Space. We'll see you guys later.